exposed on tape. Kate hit the ceiling as caught Meghan bullying Princess Charlotte in Montecito. Was Ivy Mulroney her Aunt Meghan's favorite bridesmaid? The rumor mill is once again in overdrive with allegations of bullying being thrown against Meghan Markle. But, this time, Princess Charlotte was allegedly her target, if this Tumblr post by the account called the Empresses any indication. Now, before we begin, we need to stress that this is just hearsay. We cannot confirm if it is true or false so please, do not shoot the messenger. Also, we need to mention too that Ivy Mulroney appears to have been the Duchess of Sussex's favorite bridesmaid. So, according to the anonymous post, a cousin of the poster was going on maternity leave and the best friend, of the poster's cousin, attended the dress fittings as she worked for Givenchy, the label that created Meghan's wedding dress. From what has been revealed in this rather damning post, Meghan was telling only lies and treated the Givenchy staff like dirt. Remember the rumor about how Meghan made Catherine cry? Well, it appears there was actually more than one occasion outside of the two versions we know already. Also, Markle treated her soon-to-be sister-in-law like crap, knowing very well that she was pregnant with Prince Louis. Okay, so now we're getting to the stuff which involves Charlotte and George. Apparently, Meghan didn't want her future nephew and niece to be involved at all. But, the Queen and Prince Charles were forced to step in as they were the ones paying for the wedding and the bridezilla had to obey as they were Harry's family. Meghan was incredibly horrible to the little princess and made it it painstakingly obvious she did not want her or her brother in the wedding party. She allegedly did not like how Charlotte would arrive from school a little grubby, like all children would be at that age. She even sneered at the way she spoke and referred to her as chubby. What didn't help matters is how Meghan's BFF, Jessica Mulroney got involved with the bullying of Charlotte and so did her daughter, Ivy. Charlotte made note that Meghan was going to be her aunt like Pippa was. However, Markle apparently didn't like this and sneered that she was better than Catherine's sister. The nerve of that woman. Meghan's arrogant and diva behavior in having Ivy be her favorite because Jessica is her best friend is disgusting. Who in their right mind bullies a then three-year-old? Also, Mulroney ought to be ashamed of herself. Encouraging her daughter to bully another child is not right. What if someone was mocking and belittling her children? She would want the parents to be held accountable. It should be noted also that Meghan also made it clear to the other girls who were the daughters of a college friend, they were not as good as Ivy either. Like, who the hell does that? Thank God. William and Catherine agreed to pull their daughter out of dress fittings. Who knows what might have happened. Poor little Charlotte would have been traumatized for life. Recently, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have come under fire for launching way too much pressure against the royal family and making it impossible to heal the rift. This revelation has been made by royal commentator Katie Schofield. She began by detailing the pushback being held over the firm and was quoted telling Express UK, I don't think that there's any room to heal at this point because there's so much pushback from the Sussexes. I just feel like there's so much animosity right now that they're considered outsiders, she even went on to allege. Plus we don't have much time left with the Queen and I wish that he, Harry, would heal the broken wounds that are happening right now. So that we can look in the future and one day hopefully see Harry and Meghan within the fold, maybe not working royals but invited for holidays, invited for Christmas, 